Now, your KSBW weather forecast with meteorologist Holt Hanley. Good evening. We had some warm temperatures out there today, but another big story was that prescribed fire where we did have that big smoke plume coming up this afternoon, but it looks like it's significantly calmed down as our temperatures have started to fall. And then with those calm winds, that smoke will be settling down to the surface overnight. So you may notice some moderate air quality tomorrow morning with that smoke. But again, big story today were those high temperatures. Santa Cruz Mountains, you're in the mid 90s in most places, 92 for Santa Cruz, pretty much warm enough to go in the, in the ocean just in your swimsuit today. Inland locations got up into the mid 90s. I think the big surprise though, or the most interesting thing in our temperatures today was Moss Landing hit 96 degrees. Not often you see Moss Landing warmer than Morgan Hill. We also had very warm temperatures in Salinas, up to 97 there. And then we even got into the triple digits in Greenfield. That was our warmest location today. Although certainly still are also hot in places like Carmel Valley and then in places like Seaside and Marina. So overall, very warm day today. This was the peak of that warming trend that we've pretty much been talking about all week. So just to see that trend, this is the 24 hour temperature change, almost the entire central coast about five to 10 degrees warmer than we were at this time yesterday. Now this is where this trend ends though, and then we'll actually start our next trend, which is a cool down into this weekend. It's actually gonna be a pretty major cool down. Some places cooling down by as much as 20 to 25 degrees just over the next couple of days. Now tomorrow doesn't look like it's a major cool down for the inland locations. You notice the Central Valley still right around 90 degrees. Our inland spots will cool down by maybe five degrees. And then along the coast, you can expect a significant drop of about 10 to 15 with some cities getting back into the mid 70s. So still warm out there, but not those mid 90s that we had throughout the day today. Now where this cool down is coming from is that big high pressure system in that ridge that's been slowly strengthening over the last few days is now going to start weakening and then what's going to replace it is actually a pretty big trough moving into the Pacific Northwest. You know it's associated with some cool temperatures because you see all that blue color right there. And then great news, it's actually associated with some rain and snow as well, but mostly up towards the north of us. But we'll look at that in one second. First, I just want to point out, you might have noticed some of those high clouds starting to move in around 5 or 6 p.m. I was seeing them on a couple of our live cams right now. And is actually still from that low that we were following actually Sunday, Monday earlier this week, still just hanging out off of the coast of, Cal of Southern California and pushing some of that moisture up. So we'll have some mostly cloudy skies overnight, but it's not marine layer type clouds, it's more those high clouds that will burn off tomorrow afternoon. So just to see tomorrow afternoon, looks like majority of California is still in that sunshine although we start to see the first little traces of that next system coming in on Friday and then Saturday. The biggest impacts we'll feel will be the cool down in temperatures, but you can see some widespread rain to the north of us. That's good for them. For us, it looks like we only have a slight chance of picking up a little drizzle, although still a couple days out, so we'll keep our eye on it. So overall for the coast in Salinas, pretty big cool down there. Still above average temperatures overall for the central coast, especially for the inland cities. So just to see those forecast highs back into the 80s for the Santa Cruz Mountains. Still pretty warm along the coast, although you'll want to take advantage of it while you can because there's a big cool down coming this weekend. 91 for Gilroy and then Salinas Valley is still pretty warm out there. Expecting Greenfield to cool down by about 8 degrees out of those triple digits we saw today. And then along the peninsula, mid to some low 70s, so pretty big cool down there as well. The much bigger cool down though is into Saturday and Sunday. You notice coast back into the low 60s for your highest temperatures and then even inland spots just in the low 70s.